All right, I'm just going to start in it. Um, <coughs> he sits opposite his dad with a pint on a Wednesday night. How you doing, son? He says, a question men have been answering dishonestly for years. Have you noticed as men get older, their stomachs swell in size? But they assure me when they were my age, they had a waist like mine. Say when you get older, your metabolism meets its demise, but I think that that's lies. Men swell with unspent emotions, with all the feelings that ain't masculine. Like when you don't get in a fight and score the bird and crack his chin. What about when you're vulnerable, scared? Those feelings are never aired, but they have to live somewhere and the question is where? They're swallowed indigestible, force-fed emotion because it's not in our nature to share. It's okay when we're strong, but when we're not, who the fuck cares? Stuffed, clogged up with no place to go, so some slit their wrists so the emotions can flow. The more feelings you are forced to swallow, the more your stomach has to grow because every time you swallow how you feel, the river of your expression gets dammed up, full to the popping point with fear, lies and tears, a swimming pool of unshed tears. Water that can't be sweated or pissed out. Every opportunity to cry missed out. This reservoir of water has one purpose and that's to cry, but we scorch our tear glands shut. And it stores with the swallowed emotions and it gets heavier and heavier and it hurts. It really hurts. I've swallowed fears, lies and emotions and I look at my little weight gain. Then I see his dad's fear belly and imagine his pain. And then, there's the banter, painful, desperate banter, dry swallowing your vulnerability or washing it down with lager and banter, but you have to try. Laugh real loud, because if you don't, you might cry. Cause, be a man, man up. Don't give a fuck, take it on the chin. It's a man's world, crying's for girls. You gotta be, gotta be a thug. Fuck him up, blood, because a fight is the closest thing you'll ever get to a hug. And men have been doing this their whole lives. To be a man, they paid the price and they've gained in size and their feelings they've had to sacrifice. Talking about how you feel is so vital. So when he says, How are you doing, son? Something inside the sun says, tell the truth, break the cycle, and his emotions break loose and run riot. Terrified that in this moment he might purge his emotionless diet. His dad must see this in his eyes and it all gets horribly quiet. Hold in breath. This is much more than they bargained for. The choked tears of bloke fears. Tell him, burden his soul, lighten yours. Look for an escape from this masculine order. Still holding back the choked tears of bloke fears. Oh my days. Yeah. Today's the day. The sun says, the sun rays, the truth about how he feels, even though it's years and months late. You can almost see the light through the hung haze, still holding back the choked tears of bloke fears. Do it! And then the smoke clears, and his dad appears. Terrified. Look at his eyes. Petrified if he opens wide and dredges up what he feels inside. He's trying to look calm, but the truth is, he's not scared that his son will share, but that he'll be useless. I see me in this encounter with my male friends and relatives. And for the first time I see a man much bigger and smaller than me, lost at sea, and I see me. So I talk to myself and I say, this ain't fair. He ain't ready for this. He knows that all of these emotions exist, but if you let out one, the other million might end up slitting his wrist and you don't want to be responsible for it. And he says, he asked me how I was not shit. And I say, yeah, but he didn't ask, actually wanted to know what the answer is. He had to ask, you know, you're his kid. Don't be so selfish. So he looks back at his dad and the truth about how he feels subsides. He swallows it like he swallows his vomit and pride like his dad has. It trickles down the back of his throat and right down his spine like his dad's does. The truth leaves his eyes and gets replaced by that falsified shine like his dad's do. And he feels his stomach swell in size with the tears that he won't get to cry like his dad's is. And he embraces that familiar lie and looks at his dad and says... Fine. Yeah, Dad, I'm fine.
Ja, das ist eine Szene. <lacht>